Buddies, and today we're back with another Q&A. Ah, my elbow popped. Today we're doing kind of like a different location Q&A. Let me know how you guys like that. Do you guys like this like location vibe for the Q&As or nah, not really. Tonight or today I wanted to do something a little bit different. I know I usually film in like the white chairs because they're like so pretty and nice and I'm always like, oh my God, that's so beautiful. But I don't know, I thought it'd be kind of cool to do a Q&A in my office. Yeah, <laughs> so I hope you guys like today's Q&A. If you guys do, be sure to give it a big old thumbs up. And if you do, hit that thumbs up with your buddy ball. All right, and today's first question is coming from Raish. Raish said, does Bella or Scrappy know any dog tricks? If so, can you show them? Um, Bella knows a few little tricks. I will show you. Scrappy knows how to be Scrappy. <laughs> Come here. No, not up there. Come here. Over here. Up, up. Oh god, <laughs> she knows how to get on a couch and lay down. This is really what you do for the Q&A? Speak, speak. She doesn't want to, but she knows how to do it, she just doesn't want to. She's a professional couch getter on her. Okay, so Tibet can like get his tail and do a high five and bark, but Bells is just like prissy. She's like nine years old, come here Bells, come on. Come on, come on. Ugh. Oh, she's like nine years old, so she's like not really about that. She's not really about that like trick life anymore, huh? You just wanna get up and lay on the couches and get treats. All she wants to do is get treats, that's it. She just wants to get treats and sleep and eat all day. All right, the next question is from Rachel and she said, if you could travel to any place in the world, where would it be? By the way, I love you, I love you too. Uh, if I could travel any place in the world, I don't know, it's, it's a huge like tear for me between Santorini and, which is in Greece, if you don't know where Santorini is, it's it's in Greece. Um, or, mm, I don't know. I always, like, I've always wanted to go to Italy because, I mean, I'm Italian. So, <laughs> so I feel like Italy would be pretty cool to go to just to, like, experience things. Mainly because I want to have coffee, like, real Italian espresso. Because I'm a huge coffee fan. I've been into coffee since I was, like, 12 years old. My aunt owned a coffee shop. And I know it's, like, the weirdest reason to want to go somewhere. But I've been drinking coffee, like, espresso coffee since I think I was, like, 12. Which is probably why I am the size of my DX Razor. <laughs> All right, the next question is from Detroit underscore MVP. Is there a meaning to your username or was it just a random? <laughs> um, so the reason, okay, so for like, let's rewind. Before I ever started streaming, I was really into like PC gaming in general. And I was into a game called Insurgency, which was very, very competitive. It was an indie competitive PC game. And people on that game were super like tryhards and like hardcore at it. And I was weirdly very, very good at that game. I was like definitely really good at the game. Um, so I, I made the name Lots of Bunnies because I just thought it would be funny because at the end of the at the end of each game it would say who the MVP was or like who you got killed by, and I just thought by like a flash of like lots of bunnies and my screen profile photo was also like just like a whole bunch of bunnies, or it was like the bunny where it's like <laughs> like that. So I just thought it was hilarious and when I started streaming I just kind of went with that username. I didn't really think about it and then when I created my YouTube channel I created it based off of my Twitch which which is why it's lots of bunnies. Um, so yeah, it's just kind of a random troll name that I just kept and it was cute. I think I like the name lots of bunnies. <laughs> Plus bunnies are awesome. The next question is from Sasha is a boss. <laughs> when are you going back to California? Love your videos with your grandma. Aw, thank you. Uh, I'll be back in California hopefully maybe like next month. I'm definitely thinking if not sooner definitely next month like there's nothing keeping me next month like next month I'm gonna be there no matter what. Next question is from Jad Jarkis. So what's your favorite TV show? Right now I'm watching Dragon Ball Z, which I know I'm super late and super noob to Dragon Ball Z right now, but I'm super into Dragon Ball Z. It's what I'm currently watching and it's all I've been spamming lately. Every time I watch like a show or anything, it's just Dragon Ball. I have a hiccup. It's just Dragon Ball Z. So that's what I've been watching lately. It's definitely like one of my favorite shows right now. I can't get over it. I never watched it as a kid, so now I'm watching everything like from scratch. So I don't know anything except for what I've seen, obviously. And yeah, I know everyone, I feel like everyone in the comments is gonna be like, girl, we on Dragon Ball Super now. And I'm just sitting here like, I still have to watch Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> also, if you guys were a Dragon Ball Z fan, comment down below and also let me know who your favorite character was. Our, our next question is from Nice to Meet You. Uh, will you ever come to the UK? If so, complimentary Nando's for me. 
Where's the plane? <laughs> Where's the plane? Where's the plane? I'm going. We're going. To, we're going. We're going. No, but in all seriousness, I would totally love to go to the UK. The only thing right now that's keeping me from the UK is like how much I stream. I stream six days a week. Usually it was seven. I just recently, as of like a couple of days ago, started taking Mondays off. So now I stream like six days a week, double streams usually. So I'll do like three hours in the daytime and like three hours at nighttime. So if I went to the UK, I would have to have like a place to stream from. I would also have to have like a reason to go other than like vacation, even though I would love to go there on vacation. I also don't have a passport, so I should probably work on that. <laughs> the next question is from LQ Fotball. Fotball? Fotball? Football? Fotball? Uh, how much do you eat in a day? It depends on the day, to be honest with you. Um, if I'm gonna make an eating video that day, I obviously eat like way more than like what I would usually eat but typically like the morning I'll have like three eggs and oatmeal and then I won't be hungry until about lunch and then I'll have like a lunch which might be chipotle <laughs> or it might be like some other random like outdoor food or it might just be chicken and rice and then for dinner I usually have like chicken and rice or more chipotle Next question is from Bart Grown, Bart Grown, Bart Grown, Bart T Grown, <laughs> how tall are you? <laughs> Uh, I'm five foot, so I'm really little. Here's my DX racer for scale. This DX racer is me. <laughs> and yeah, that, that's, that's how tall I am. I'm five foot. All right, the next question is from Scone Plays YT. What's the best food you've tried on your YouTube channel? Hi from England, hi from DC. Uh, and the best food I think I've tried on my channel is probably like Nando's, 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 whatever you want to call it, N-A-N-D-O-S, Nando's, no, no, Nando's, Nando's, anyways, probably that, or, ooh, I would say that's definitely like up there with me. The Nando's. <laughs> the Nando's. I don't want to pronounce it because I know it, everyone's going to just sleep me in the comments. All right, our next question is from FRHM680, or I'm not even going to try and pronounce your name. I'm just going to butcher it. <laughs> um, do you think of getting married anytime soon? Oh my god, no. Um, I mean, no, not, not no, but like, I don't, I don't think so. I don't know. Like, I don't, I don't know. I don't think so. I mean, depends on like how soon soon is for you. <laughs> Cause for me, soon is like tomorrow or in a month or two months. And for me, I think even if I did get engaged at like some point ever in my life, if somebody ever wants to take on the responsibility <laughs> or like having to deal with me every day, um, I think it takes like what like a year to plan a wedding anyways So I would say like it would be years before I ever got married anyways and like as of right now I don't have any plans of get like that. I know of, of getting married. <laughs> the next question is from Miss Cronito <laughs> I'm just gonna call you Ness. Um, are you ever gonna do a soccer video? Yes I am or a football video depending on like where you're from and what your trigger is. I am from Cali <laughs> I'm from the States, so we call it soccer here, but Ant hangs around a lot of Europeans, so, and he's European, obviously he's Portuguese, so he calls it football. So I say like, I go back, I bounce back and forth between football and soccer, so you know what I'm saying, so please don't get triggered in the comments, like, oh my God, it's not called this, it's called that, you stupid, I know. <laughs> Anyways, uh, I will definitely be doing another video or a video with soccer slash football, whatever you want to call it. Um, so I actually have a big soccer or football that you inflate and you can actually like get inside of. Sounds really weird. <laughs> but there's like a big manhole in the soccer ball and it, you just crawl into it and people can push you in this gigantic soccer ball and around. So I'm going to be doing a soccer video or a football video with me inside a soccer ball, which is really weird sounding, but it's like a blow up soccer ball. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of anything like that, but that's basically what it is. I'm going to be inside a soccer ball and it's going to kick me around. <laughs> Sounds kind of abusive. It's going to kick me around and I'm yeah, I'm gonna film it. So um, I think that'll be super, super awesome. The next question is from Jesper. Do you ever rage about a video game? Yes! Uh, when I don't stream, I rage a lot, actually. I'm like a hardcore rager where I start yelling. <laughs> Like when I play Overwatch off stream, if you guys don't know or watch my stream, I play Overwatch almost every single day in stream. I'm not a good Overwatch player. 
at least I can't, I'm in elo hell, like I can't get out of elo hell ever. And like when I start to like, when I start to come out of the elo butt crack, I'm like, hey guys, I'm here. And then we just die and we just, and I go back and I sink back into elo hell. So I can't get out of it. But when I'm offline and I'm not streaming, I take it very seriously and like I get really into it. So when I'm like really into it and something happens, I'll just start yelling I'm like, oh my god, are you freaking kidding me? Come on, man, you idiots. That's how I rage. But I'm not smiling. <laughs> Next question is going to be from Silas Jensen. <laughs> uh, what's your favorite cereal? P.S. Love your videos. P.S. Love you. Uh, my favorite cereal right now. I don't really eat cereal, like oh, cold cereal, like I eat hot cereal, which is oatmeal, but I don't eat really cold cereal very often right now. If I had to eat cold cereal, I would say like, I like live cereal a lot. It's just really good, the cinnamon kind is like my favorite. But other than that, I really love, ooh, Captain Crunch's peanut butter crunch. It's life, or Cocoa Puffs are good, or anything is good. Um, I like cookies are super okay. They're not like the best for me. They're okay. Um, but yeah, I would say I don't really like, like I used to love soggy cereal. So I like the cereal where it was like Captain, or not Captain Crunch, um, Cinnamon Toast Crunch and Cookie Crisps and um, Chocolate Pebbles, stuff like that because I like my cereal to get all soggy and then I would eat it. But now I hate soggy cereal and I only like crunchy cereal. So now I don't really care for those cereals very much anymore unless I eat them dry. Um, it's so weird. So now I like like Captain Crunches. <laughs> They're really good. What are some of your guys' favorite cereals? Comment down below. Let me know if I'm the only person who likes live cereal. <laughs> Alright guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, be sure to give it a big old thumbs up. And if you want to ask a question for the next Q&A, the next Q&A is going to be on Instagram. So I'll be posting like a picture midweek or like something like that, just look out for it, comment on it, ask any question there. And if you want to be featured on a Twitter, Instagram, um, hashtag AskLOV, and I will hopefully answer your question. Thank you guys so much for all the questions. Bye! <laughs>